Welcome, Molly Davis. Where... Where am I? You are in the Beacon of Light in the Treasure Dragon's Fortress. Treasure Dragons? I know of you! You're about to do great things. Indeed. Who are you, really? I am Thrysix, great dragon of legacy. I am Maxillion, great dragon of justice. I am Bathill, great dragon of foresight. I am Aurelia, great dragon of knowledge. I am Fargo, great dragon of decisiveness. Who's he? He's Corbican, the great dragon of dreams. Without his power, we cannot communicate with you. Corbican, show her your power. Uh. Three, two, one. Katniss! Alright. I really shouldn't have to... I really shouldn't have read Hunger Games before I went to bed. Ugh. Ha, that was good, Krivikant. High five! Uh, uh. Oh yeah, we can't move. Great. Um, I wonder if I should practice my powers. Although it's really anticlimactic since everybody else does it on YouTube. But still. Good. I practice my powers. Well, that's convenient. Well, coincidental. Maybe. Go for a, a flight session too. Come on. Wow, it's really nice up here. Cool breeze. Uh oh, change in wind. Whoa. I might be an amateur at flying, but uh, at least I can freeze well. Man, I'm bored. There's nothing to do. My homework's done. My... I'm finished, caught up with all my reading. There's nothing on TV. There has to be something. Something! 
the dragon notebook. Maybe that, that has something for me to do. Whoa. In the Middle Ages, dragons were banished due to unethical treatment between dragons and humans. The humans thought dragon slayers killed on the Mohawk while the treasure dragons granted the dragon world as a peaceful place. But all was not well. We had our times of peace, no human interference, but some of us escaped back into the human world and lived amongst humans, hiding their true identities. Boring! Ooh! Invisibility spell. Flaflex, Archiflex, Goroflex. Sounds like some sort of a painkiller. Oh. Let's try this out. Flamflex, Argiflex, Goroflex. It worked. Where did it go? Hmm. Flamflex, Argoflex, Goreflex. Whoa, I'm completely invisible. Time to do stuff only invisible people can do. I don't have anyone to haunt though. This is getting boring really fast. Oh, I know. Hello? Your mom. Seriously, Morley? A 12 year old wouldn't even find that funny. I'm invisible. Didn't see that one coming, right? Ha! Yeah, well, I'm not really that interested. Sean? Yeah? Go kiss a cow. Okay, crazy dragon girl. This is never gonna wear off. When will I be Oak Pig again? I'm gonna be invisible. Well, forever. <laughs> Wait, I'm this. I'm this bull again. Oh, my God. Thank you. Thank the Lord. Oh, Sean, thank God you called. Yeah, Marley? Yeah? That cow I just kissed was your mother. Boo! That <clears throat> Why must my dreams be always filled with dragons? They said I should try to locate one of the treasures, but how do I do that? Now I have this stalking me. 
freaking cute necklace. Use this to locate the treasures, Aurelia. Okay, sounds like a treasure hunt. Somebody must not want me to find the treasures. Hmm. Be careful of dragons in human form. They may want to steal your treasures and will stand in your way. So, a dragon cursed my a necklace to make me not, not track down the treasures. And it'll only make me dance. So, you can see it as a bad thing, but. Wait, didn't I, I put, put the dragon notebook here? Where did it go? Dragon notebook. Hello. Dragon 
notebook. Uh-oh. Is that back? Wait. Y y you're me. Ha ha ha. No. I'm Nice Garrus, the great doppelganger dragon. And and I will bring this this notebook to my my master. Her Greg's. Higgs, the great hate leader of the Green Dragon Clan. He will, will then make me the greatest his dragon of all time. And we will, will rule the world. Old dragon and human world. But you're in the human world. He just can't go all around looking like me. I don't want a twin. I don't care. Greg's? Hmm. Hold on, I think I got, got something you, your leader would like. Here. It's a pendant that... It's a treasure... Her pendant that, that will help unlock of the portal. You can use a, this for your leader to, to get more dragons to invade here from the dragon world. Really? Sure, just give me the notebook and, and I'll give you this official treasure. Her. Wait a minute. Didn't I? No. Good job. Thanks. You are a truly great draconis. Do use your ice powers wisely or they might overload. Mm. Just one more test. Yakashaw. Oh yeah. I'm the ice queen. Move over, Elsa. Move. You want I play with magic, come play with me. No! Yeah! yeah. Oh. This isn't over. Huh? Cold. You will feel this cold for three hours until your temperature goes up. Keep warm with blankets until then. <sighs> three hours of this coldness. Oh. There's some new text in the Dragon Notebook. The treasures will have a mind of their own. Don't worry, they'll be dedicated to your cause, Maxillion. 
I wonder if I'll find a treasure. Dee doo dee doo. Well, I wonder if this is the right address. That's the doorbell. Guess it, it might be pizza. Well, hello. Uh, hi. Are you a draconis? Yeah. Aha, then I am at the right place. Who are you? And I'm the dragon bottle. The one that you so sick. Really? Well, let me carry you inside. Oh, take it easy. Wow, I actually found a treasure. You can ask me a few questions. Okay, um... Where did she come from? The treasure comes from the dragon world. We have been created by the treasure dragons and are scattered in the human world. Do all treasures talk? No! I am the only one. I have been cursed by the treasure dragons to be the pawn in that evil chess game. They aren't evil. Then why do those fucking bastards put me in that fucking bottle? I don't know. I guess I have a lot of visitors today. <laughs> do you know where I can find a dragon bottle that talks? No. He's here! I know it! Molly! Are you okay? Oh yeah! Oopa ducks! Eee! Get me some whiskey! It for cheap! Ah! Uh, my powers... They're failing me! Oh... Stay back, girl. Freeze your heart solid. Okay, I give. Greg's isn't gonna like this. We make a good team.